God is speaking to you right now. 11.11 11, This is the time for supernatural favor. I have a fantastic strategy for your life. This is your chance to recover. Your experiences have only strengthened and prepared you. You have been chosen to achieve success and are rewarded. If you're ready, type 11.11. 11. Today I speak numerous blessings over you. Every rift in your life that needs repairing and pleasure is addressed by me. I offer a prompt arrival on what has been postponed. I declare that you will experience God's favor during this time. God won't withhold anything nice from you. Your time has come. If you believe in God, please watch this video. I will never leave you in a dangerous circumstance. I come first. I am next to you. I follow in your wake. Be assured that I am with you no matter what you are going through right now. You're in for a busy week this week, I announce that you will enjoy a string of victories, healing, unanticipated benefits, growth, financial gain, and enlightenment. I hope you get whatever you want in life. In the name of Jesus, Amen. God tells the child, don't let your past concerns force you to compromise on the things I have planned for you. You won't trip or make a mistake, I am all around you, and I will raise you so high that there will be areas where we can be even closer. Let's jump, trust me, sweetheart, never forget that not even a single second goes by without my presence, I'll therefore be jumping with you. Let me show you the wonders I have in store for you. You have my support, your psychological, emotional, and material circumstances will all be completely different after three months. Continue to read God's word, pray, and improve yourself, God. Will lavish you with unimaginable blessings. Don't be ashamed of your flaws or afraid of them, advises God. You are exactly how I made you, and I appreciate that. Avoid attempting to pretend. Let's discuss it jointly as a substitute. I will supply anything that is missing. I will make you feel better if you're hurt. I adore you terribly, my child. Let me assist you. All that you have prayed for and believed God for is so close at hand. This morning, I had a strong want to let someone know everything that was promised to you is only around the corner. In this campaign, don't doubt it. It is here, I feel it. God's moved. You are about to experience a very specific event. God declares the stress you're under won't break you instead. I'm using it to strengthen you. I heard your child's prayer. I'm shining a light on who you really are. You will find the calm you crave for once you figure out how to give me back control of your life, my little child. I adore you over and over again. God will continue to bless you while taking your test. Try not to worry. Everything for which you have waited and prayed will bounce back to you. You may trust in God to deliver. This Wednesday, keep in mind these eight things. 1. Trust in God. God will see you through this difficult time. What needs fixing, he will fix. Repot in him, too. All will go as planned. God is aware of the scope of your goals. You can trust him. 3. God will give you courage when you feel like giving up. When you are depressed, he will make you joyful, even when it seems impossible. 
he will find a solution for it. You will experience healing compared to before. You are returning stronger and better. 5. Give God your whole attention, not my storm. 6. God is preparing you for a miracle. You are experiencing your breakthrough this week. 7. You're going to experience your happiest moment in memory. Observe God's next action. 8. Your best days are still in front of you. If you love God, subscribe to our channel. God declares, love people more than you care about how they treat you. You never learn from me to treat others the way they treat you. Be more kind to them. People are taught to treat others the same way they want to be treated, but that's not how I roll. I am loving and merciful. All of your accomplishments make me happy. Everything you need will be given to you if you pray to me and ask for it. Put your trust in God I adore you. Entering I am becoming aware will confirm. God declares I gave you life, but it is not for you. You were made in my likeness to live for me and to be a love and aid and a comfort to others. Find your goal by seeking me out. Don't do what you want and ask me to tell you what I want from you instead. I adore you. Be sympathetic. Try to put yourself in the shoes of others to understand how challenging it can be. Be kind because you are privileged. Not everyone is. Rise up, says God. Be not afraid, I've planned an exciting and breathtaking adventure for you. You'll be a lot more powerful and bring me a ton of honor. Never be terrified of people. Little one, along with you, nothing created against you will ever be successful. I cherish you. God is telling you this day, I know the path that lies ahead. My brave little warrior, there are no more issues, and the way is clear. My little one, please, take a nap. Enjoy the tranquilly and benefits I have prepared for you today. I'll show you the route when the moment is perfect. Just trust me for the time being, and don't worry about breaking your little heart. I am in charge of the situation, and I will never permit the corrupt people's schemes to succeed. God has both your past and your future covered. There's no need for fear any longer who or what can oppose you if God is for you. It's taken care of according to God. The solution is already in place and, my child, you have won. Don't allow anyone bring you down as you move forward, walk with confidence. My folks must see that you have faith in me, sweet kid. Let my light enter this world by widening your heart. Remain calm. Why are you doubting God in this scenario after? He delivered you from the one that you once believed would be the end of you. Everything is possible with God. 11-11 eleven, eleven, all will be well for you. Stop constantly questioning your abilities. It's time. Although the load you are currently bearing is incredibly heavy, you are still very powerful. Today is the perfect time to assess what is dragging you down and remove it. Anyone reading this who has gone through it is going through it or has already overcome it is intended. Positivity, blessings, and keeping your head up are all important. Do you ever feel like you're hollow inside? It's like though your heart is completely spent with broken pieces that don't fit together. Your thoughts are like a puzzle. 12-12, it will all make sense when you awaken one day. 
You'll understand the purpose of the suffering you experienced. You'll come to understand that God always heard and always provided a solution. Both delight and a thorough grasp of the conflict will fill you to the brim. Wait till you see the blessing that this conflict has to provide. It will become clear to you soon you have access to God's stimulus plan. If you put God first, He will put you first. To carry out the tasks that God has given you will need you to spend everything. Sometimes we quickly pray for the test too. And when we are being tested, ask God to reveal to you what you are too. Learn from this test instead, and quit avoiding your growth. That is the reason you keep climbing the same mountain. Everyone is screaming for a breakthrough, yet nobody wants to fall apart. Simply enter I am open to life to confirm. God will give you stamina beyond what you can physically muster if he sees you doing your part trusting in him even when you don't see any evidence of it, giving him thanks when you're weak, and taking steps of faith even when it's uncomfortably painful. He'll assist you in doing something you couldn't do on your alone. God is telling you tonight to rest if you're lying in bed right now feeling dejected, worn out, and uncertain about when things will get better, already in the office. Every unfavorable circumstance in your life will be changed, and I will bless your entire family as well as all the aching places in you. Think again if you believe it to be over. God is never done. Moving in Jesus' name, I declare that something will change. A battle you've been fighting is going to get better. Previously closed doors are now opening. It's not finished yet. God is about to act in your favor. Type Amen to affirm. You are about to receive some benefits from God that will help you forget your past experiences, your attackers, your losses and unfairness Although you have already had two doses of difficulty, you will soon experience two doses of good fortune. That which you could never bring about, God is about to do. You won't have to engage in combat since he will turn the circumstance around. Chances are in your favor. Your life is in God's hands, it never fails that God provides right on schedule. In tumultuous circumstances, God will deliver you. You are his child with the Father, you are one. According to Psalm 23 to 4, you were not made to handle life's stresses alone. Before dawn, it is always the darkest. Why are you concerned if God is so concerned that he counts the hairs on your head, you are in his hands. Right, I love you, God. Whatever is trying to hold you back, whether it's a mountain of debt, a mountain of illness, a mountain of depression, or a mountain of addiction might appear insurmountable to you, but it can't compare to our God with just a little bit of his favor. He can level that mountain Today, God is telling you to have faith in Him. Even when you don't comprehend what He is doing, compared to your ways, mine are superior. Simply have faith that everything is conspiring in your favor. You will receive rewards for following my instructions and remaining obedient to me, a life of faith. Consider me, you, have me, This is what you need right now if you're looking for assurance. It will be all right for you. Your way will be filled with blessings, your perseverance, 
has made God incredibly pleased of you, it will all work out well. Right I taking my power back to confirm. Keep on adoring when the suffering becomes too much to bear. He is there. He will not let you down when he is holding you during the trial he is aware of. The harm they caused you, he holds the tears you shed close to his chest and a bottle. He's going to take this suffering and give it a wonderful replacement. Something fantastic is just getting started. This is not the end. He beautifies everything in due course. They predicted you wouldn't survive. God is telling you today. You didn't deserve it. They claim they tempt it to prevent you from getting my finest. No, my child that I am the source of your successes and benefits. No one will be able to steal, stop, or destroy what I promised. You remain faithful. I am about to show you my gifts in abundance. Tonight, God is whispering to you. I know you are suffering in pain in secret. Every night you sob yourself to sleep because you don't want to bother anyone. You are at a loss for what to do next. I am aware of the situation. I am caring and I am perceptive. I'm already doing my best to represent you rest. In the palm of my hand I hold you. You'll wake in the following day feeling renewed and knowledgeable. You are being told by God that he is aware of your broken heart today. Although I am close to the brokenhearted, I am aware that moving on can be difficult. I'll wrap and cover your wounds to help you recover. Although the process of healing will take some time, as long as you keep coming into my presence every day, you will have the fortitude to stand up and accept the love, thankfulness, and fate I haven't planned for you. What you are experiencing now will shortly come to an end. God is using the fire to burn off the rough edges and to bring the impurities to the surface even though he knows you are in the fire. Please have faith in the procedure. God is working greatly in you. You will emerge from this situation stronger, more positive, and more prosperous than you were before. You will be at a higher level. God has given you a destiny and a dream, and you will be ready to fulfill them. This evening, I want you to say thank you, Father, for purifying me. Right, I embrace my power to affirm. I want to express my gratitude to God for all of my blessings. Today I kneel before you and beg for your pardon for my transgressions. You give me life, are my savior and are my strength. I give you everything. Make me holy and as white as snow. Cleanse my soul, purify my psyche and help me recover from my past injuries, I pray that you will lead my loved ones, my friends, and even my foes to your unending love. I adore you and depend on you. Amen. Please, and forward this to a friend who needs it. Prepare for innovations. Prepare for a promotion. Prepare for recovery. That issue may have plagued you for a very long time, but Today might be the day that it becomes better. Things can change quickly. God wants people to see his splendor in you. He wants you to be noticed among the others. He desires for you to be so blessed that those around you may witness his goodness. Because blessings and favor are on the way, continue to stand, to believe, to hope and to proclaim his word. God is still working with you. 
Your later years will be superior to your earlier ones. The beginning is not where you are right now. You are about to enter the next realm thanks to God. You won't end up where you started. Therefore, don't allow your current situation demotivate you. The magnificence you've already experienced on this level is just a preview of what's to come. Prepare yourself for your final years. It will only get better if you keep going forward. I speak many blessings over you today. Even though you began out with little, you will end up with much. Every shattered part of your life receives delight and mending from me on what has been delayed. I speak quickly. You will experience God's favor during this time, I declare. Nothing good will be withheld from you by God. The time is now. Ensure your own well-being. If you're ready, just type yes. Then send this video to five people you know who believe in God. Please turn on bell notifications if you want to support our channel and subscribe.